The U.S. president's daughter-in-law, Vanessa Trump, was taken to hospital as a precaution after opening an envelope containing white powder, police say. The letter was addressed to Donald Trump Jr., Mr. Trump's eldest son, at his apartment in Manhattan. Mrs. Trump and two others at the scene were decontaminated by firefighters and taken to hospital for evaluation. NYPD told the BBC they tested the white powder in the envelope and confirmed that it was non-hazardous. They said that Mrs. Trump did not appear to be physically affected by the substance. Mr. Trump Jr. tweeted later on Monday that his family was safe and called the incident disgusting. U.S. President Donald Trump spoke to Mrs. Trump Jr. White House spokeswoman Sarah Sanders confirmed at the Daily News briefing. The Fire Department of New York, FDNY, referred calls from the media to police, but confirmed that three people had been transported to the Wall Cornell Medical Center. The call came to police at around 10 o'clock local time, 15 Greenwich Mean Time, according to local officials. They said the couple's East 54th Street apartment was now being decontaminated. According to CBS New York, Vanessa Trump's mother handed the envelope, which Vanessa then opened. The Secret Service said it is investigating a suspicious package addressed to one of our protectees received today. In September, Mr. Trump Jr., 40, chose to forego Secret Service protection for himself, his wife and their five children, but it was reactivated one week later. Donald Trump Jr., who works for his father's business, married Mrs. Trump, the Vanessa K. Hayden in November 2005 at the President's Mar-a-Lago Resort in Florida. Mr. Trump Jr.'s aunt, Judge Marianne Trump Barry, officiated at the ceremony. Before wedding Mr. Trump Jr., Mrs. Trump was a fashion model in New York, who is the new first family of the U.S. She had appeared in TV adverts and the film Something's Gotta Give, starring Jack Nicholson and Diane Keaton. The 40-year-old former Miss USA contestant once had a handbag company, La Pochette, which is now defunct. Officials have been on alert for toxic substances sent through the mail since 2001 when anthrax was posted to lawmakers and journalists, killing five people. Please subscribe channel. Thank you for watching.